welcome to Swaksha Spectrum. Today is one of those hottest days where no amount of water is enough to quench my thirst. But I think a slushy would help satisfy. So let's try making a slushy. So I started off by pouring the watermelon slices into the blender because I wanted a watermelon flavored slushy. But you can choose any other fruit. And now I'm going to be adding some lemon to give it a more sour taste. And just squeezing it in. Now I'm going to be adding some mint leaves to give it some freshness. And now I'm adding some salt to give it some more flavor. And some pepper as well. And finally, now I'm adding in some black salt. Now that I've put everything in the blender, now it's time to blend it all together. Here we are blending. And now we're all done with blending, so we can take it out. So here is after I finished blending it. You can drink it just like this as a smoothie, but I want it to be cooler, so I'm going to make it a slushy. So now I'm just pouring the drink over a strainer in order to strain it so that we can remove the pulp from the water. So I also ended up adding sugar and now I'm just mixing that in. Here is after I mixed it in and I also put it in a container so that it's easy to freeze. And now you can put this in the freezer until it's completely frozen. So I actually ended up letting mine freeze overnight, so here it is. And now I'm just scraping it in order to give it that slushy texture. And now I'm just scooping out some chunks of watermelon to add to my slushy. Now I'm just adding all the shavings in into the cup with the watermelon. I'd also already soaked some chia seeds and I'm going to be adding that in, which basically just helps add a jelly-like texture. and a mint sprig on top. And finally, a straw. And here is all done. Uh, it tastes so good. I feel very refreshed and I no longer feel like I'm going to melt. This is the perfect drink to beat the heat. That's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Till then, bye.